whatever. This is the brick separator. I am the zombie J, and we're gonna tear this thing down. This is fucking worthless. What's scary about it is that I have two of these sons of bitches. Why? Because they include these in sets nowadays. This has been going on for like the past three or four years at this point. Two of these. So, what you're supposed to do with this thing, and let's look at the thing real quick. This one's in teal, which is a nice color to have. I know some Bionicle sets, or sets from that, that era, that had color of this distinction. But, you know? So, it has this axle. Okay, I can see that being uh, potentially useful. You got this... Uh, ribbing thing right there you got skeletal outside you got the anti-stud area you got the studded area so what you're supposed to do and we're going to use this thing that i uh got i can't remember how i think it's from some thing what you're supposed to do all right you're supposed to put this like this and do that so that's easier for you to uh, take the thing apart. The thing is, you can just do it like this. Without the damn thing. This is one of the most useless tools I've ever seen. Now, you can also do it like this, on this, using the anti, or using the studded surface. It's not working all that well. There we go. But again, like with the other side, you can just tear it off like that. The axle, supposed to take out ax um it's supposed to push out axle rods and make them fall out i guess or something to that effect and well that's interesting well yeah you can do that too apparently so you can do that with this but i could just tear this whole thing in half and you know you know this is ridiculous lego I think that's a rarity. Why did you feel the audacity? Why did you have you, you had the audacity to give us this piece, give us this thing, and you know somehow I ended up with two of these fuckers, and is the most useless thing I've ever seen. One of the most useless tools I've ever seen to take apart Legos. You don't even need a tool. The only tool you need are your fucking hands. You know. You can take a brick off of a set just like that. You just got to apply pressure like this. It's not hard. It's easy. It's dead easy. It's piss easy. This is just a piss poor uh, take on how to disassemble uh, Lego sets. It's for tricky things, though. I get that. But still, this is fucking bullshit. The fact that I have two of these really says something, you know? It's the fact that LEGO is trying to uh, do whatever they can to, I guess, bump up the cost, and this is a good way to bump up the cost by probably another couple of cents. Oh, goody! The fact that these exist really just draws my piss to a boil, because nobody in their right mind needs these. You don't need these to take apart sets, just use your fingers, use your hands, use your fingertips, if you have any at all. And if you do have trouble taking out like a stud, like a symbol like uh, a circular stud piece out of a base plate, for example, get a screwdriver, plop it off, and it goes. It goes flying, you can still find it, I bet. This is bullshit. Now, the only potential use I can see these being used for mock making is that these, run, remember slicers or throwbots? There was a white and blue slicer uh, that had something uh, for skis. Well, we got the modern equivalent of those now. These can be used as skis. You can put a. Um, uh, I don't have one on hand, but you can put uh, an old school 
uh, or even the modern uh, uh, ball joint socket onto these, have two of them, and these can be the feet and skis for a teal character. That could work, and even build off on it a little bit, but that's it. That's the only thing I can see this being used for in terms of mock making. This is just absolutely fucking balls. Why, Lego, did you feel like you have to make us feel like we're too dumb to take apart a set? It's not hard. It's easy. It's piss easy. You're just making some kind of excuse to either bump up the cost or just, you know, make us look stupid. Well, we're not stupid. You're stupid for this. Fuck you. This is absolute fucking insane. This is one of the most asinine excuses of a piece that I could ever come across. This does not need to exist. It is only applicable for one use, and that's for potentially making a teal colored uh, slicer revamp sort of thing. That's all I can think of. If you have a better use for this thing, too bad. <sighs> Nobody needs this. If you get one of these in your sets within the past four years, take this and throw it away. Where's the other one? There it is. If you get one of these with each and every set that requires it, but doesn't. Toss it away and let it be done. Unless you're gonna make an arctic character with those as skis, then just, yeah. Avoid this piece at all costs. It is not worth it. It's not worth, you know, keeping. It's not even worth collecting to have all the colors in the world of this piece. It's not worth it. Fuck this piece. Flush it down the toilet. Burn it. Get rid of it. End of the game. That's it. Lego. If I need a tool to take apart this, there is really is a problem. There really is. I can take this thing apart stupidly easy, and it's not even funny at this point. It's... You're basically stooping to a low of some kind with this piece. It really is stupid, it really is sad, and I hate it. Stop including this piece with your sets and that's all there really is to it. It's worthless, it's useless, it's terrible. There is an orange colored uh, variant of this piece which could be used for a... Oh, why not? Why, why, why do I even bother? This set, this piece is not even a piece. It's a tool, it's a worthless tool, and I'd rather listen to the band tool.